Hi, welcome back from the holidays. This is our level one New Year's lesson plan. This lesson runs from January 2nd to January 4th. First, we have our vault stations. Our first station will be working on our run, proper hurdle, straight from front of the springboard, landing on two feet. If the students are ready, we may add height or try different body positions when we jump. Our second station will be a proper hurdle drill, so the students will run, hurdle over the puzzle mat, land in the hula hoop, and jump out. Our third station will be working on our run. The students will run, pushing the orange block down the runway, turn around, and push it back, running as fast as they can, pushing with straight arms. Our last station will be working on donkey kicks, so the students will put their hands on a height-appropriate block and bounce straight legs, trying to drive through heels as high as they can, keeping their arms and legs straight. Bar stations. Our first station will be a spotted station. We're working on our chin-up pullover from the high block. We'll do our three casts, back hip circle if we're ready, with a spot, and then forward roll to a chin-up, working on control and independence. Our second station will be on the low bar. We'll be doing our three tuck swings in a row. So the students will hang with straight arms, pull their knees to their chest, and swing three times, keeping straight arms and holding their knees up as high as they can. Our third station will be on the floor bar, and we'll be working on our birdie perch. So hands together, one foot at a time on the bar, standing and jumping, landing on our feet, staying in control. Our last station will be on the high bar and the students will hang with straight arms and a tight body and they'll be trying to switch their grip. So they'll switch one hand backwards at a time and then trying to switch back to straight arms without falling down. Floor beam stations. Our first station will be on the pink beam We'll be walking forward to the green dot, then we'll stop, do a pivot turn in releve, and then walk backwards to the end of the pink beam. When we get to the end, we'll turn around and jump off. Our second station will be on the blue floor beam, and we'll be trying donkey kicks. So we'll have two hands together, and we'll be hopping two feet, moving our hands at the same time, trying to get our hips over our head, and have a good rhythm. Our third station will be on the red beam and we'll be working on our jumps. So we'll walk to the first picture, have beam feet, and do our straight jumps. Then walk to the second picture, beam feet, one foot in front, and try our tuck jump. Our last station will be on the high low beam and we'll be alternating two different walks. So our first turn we'll be doing backwards, working on our brush touch step, using our foot to feel for the beam behind us. Then on our second turn, we'll be working on our forward in relevant. So arms up, high on our toes, keeping straight legs and not letting our heels drop. Floor stations. Our first station, we're going to be doing a cartwheel drill against the wall. So they'll cartwheel to a straddle handstand and then step down, focusing on landing one foot at a time in a lunge. Our second station will be a spotted station at the cheese mat. The students will start at the bottom of the cheese mat, arms up, and they'll back bend to a bridge, working towards independence and moving down the cheese. Our third station, gonna, the students will put their hands on the floor, their feet on the mat in a push-up, and they'll walk sideways, staying in their push-up, all the way down and all the way back. Our last station will be working on our jumps with the flashcards, so they'll work on their tuck jump, their straddle jump, and their split jump. 